I remember seeing your video and I felt so extremely drawn to your energy because it's so magic, you know. You, at some point you just offered me that there's another way to look at things and to transform things. So I felt magically attracted to that program you offered during that time. Secondhand, I was looking at the topic or just realizing that, oh, nice, that there's some topic I can really, it resonates with me and there is some issue I can address to this topic. So it will bring me forward. I didn't know that actually I'm looking forward to attract a man in my life, a new man, but the whole intention of mine was just to have a look at this topic and just to get real with where I'm at and what I want to attract. And this is absolutely amazing. Aha moments I had somewhere just that I'm not alone, that there are so many women experiencing the same difficulties, experience the same challenges or opportunities, and that there is a lot of resistance within myself and I can see around myself to really get sure with what you want to manifest or what you want to attract. Realizing that there's still some part in me that has fear, you know, of taking the next step and to receive love, to actually take the courage and stepping out of the role I'm familiar with. This was a huge aha moment. So yeah, yeah, this was the biggest, the biggest one. I felt really connected to the group and to your program when I did your exercises. So the orgasmic manifestation practice or the breast meditation. I felt so connected to this energy and at some point to the group that this was really nourishing to me. During this exercises, I could sense that there is a group that is holding me. I react different than I am used to. Example, having like boundaries and saying no this is not what i want to attract taking the responsibility moving away from this image i'm familiar with and saying no this is not what i want to being really clear about that you know being like okay this doesn't have to mean that you're wrong or i'm wrong but it's just simply not where i wish to move this is a huge shift becoming more and more aware of my patterns of my blind spots you know? <laughs> and as well talking to myself over and over again that I'm not worthy of love I'm not you know this you can you can work with it by yourself but it makes a difference when there comes a different energy into this process that just says no you go there <laughs> you don't you don't avoid you go there and this is beautifully yeah it's what you do it's what you do so. Oh, yeah, and I recognize a huge shift with being more receptive of my feminine energy and m m nurturing my son in a different way that I used to nurture him because it was really like very set up, you know, when to, when we do this, when we do that. And now it's like more more of a flow, not all the time, not all the time, but there's definitely some softness that arises within the relationship of me and my son. It takes courage and a huge step, you know, to, to work with you, Christiana, and I really admire what we have done so far together, like what I've been through. And I can only advise that this step is so tremendously powerful and um, so worth it. It's so worth it to work with you, any, any program given, <laughs> because there can be a way to live wholeheartedly within yourself and from that place to really attract what you're longing for for so long and that it is really, really necessary for every one of us and we are worthy of it.